If you do sales prospecting, I think I'm about to change the game for you forever. So what if you could put down a list of companies that you are interested in? Tesla, SpaceX, click one button and get back a spreadsheet with all of the executives from those companies. <laughs> I know, that sounds pretty insane. This is why in this video, I'm going to show you how to do sales prospecting on steroids using some automations. Specifically, we're going to make a list of companies with just one click. Then we're going to click another button and use another automation to source all of the people that have a certain job title that you're interested in. And finally, we're going to do some magic and use artificial intelligence to write hyper-personalized outreach messages specifically for each one of those people. Sounds pretty insane. Let me show you how it works. First things first, I will need a list of companies and the LinkedIn URLs. Let me show you how to get those edit into a spreadsheet using our first automation. We're going to be using a workflow automation tool called Bardeen for all of the automations you're about to see. Link to download it in the description, including the link to the automation itself. Here I have an empty spreadsheet. Then I'm going to go to find the company that I'm interested in and open up Bardeen and click on this card, copy LinkedIn company to a spreadsheet. And boom, just like this, we have the first company edit. I'm going to repeat this for two more companies like Notion and Airtable. By the way, there are many more pre-built automations that can save company information into a spreadsheet. There is one for Crunchbase, or you can build one from scratch from pretty much any website. In order to learn how to use the custom scraper, just click on the card over there and you will be led to a tutorial video. Finally, the automation you've been waiting for. We're going to get a list of, say, salespeople from those companies. Let me show you how to do this. We're starting out with a list of three companies and their company LinkedIn profiles. And then I'm going to use this pre-built automation called find all job roles for a list of LinkedIn companies. Here I have it pinned. You can download it in the description of this video. And the first argument is to pick a spreadsheet. This spreadsheet is called People Inspector. And then I have a column called LinkedIn. So I'm going to specify the column name. This column needs to include all of the company LinkedIn URL profiles. Next up, what type of people do I want to source from those companies? I'm going to look for all of the executives. And the final argument is the name of the new tab that will be created in the spreadsheet. Let's run this automation. As you can see, Bardeen is scraping information from those web pages in the background right now. This process might take about a minute or so, depending on how many companies you have and how many contacts there are. And by the way, because scraping is happening in the background, you can click on this hide button. The automation is running. You can click on the activities tab and click on in progress to see this job running. Let's go back to our spreadsheet and wait for a second more. Okay, there is a new tab that was created all execs. Let's click on it to check it out. So here we have all of the executives over here. For this demo, I'm using an empty LinkedIn account. So obviously I'm not connected to anybody at those companies. So uh, most of the people are going to be my third degree connections. And this is why we are not even seeing some of the names because of their privacy settings. But the results would be way, way better if you were using your own LinkedIn account that already is connected to some of these people. And so already a good start. Let's format the spreadsheet a little bit. I'm going to freeze the first row that has all of the titles. And then let's sort the spreadsheet so we have all of these people that were recognized. And just like this, in a few minutes, we've sourced 46 profiles of executives. It's pretty insane, right? If you found this automation valuable, please leave a thumbs up under this video. It will go a super long way for us. Let's elevate things up a little bit. Now that we have a perfect list of contacts, the calls are not going to book themselves. So let's use artificial intelligence to write hyper personalized outreach messages to each one of these people. Let me show you how to do it. Back to our perfect spreadsheet of prospects. Now we need to use AI inside Google Sheets. For that, we're going to be using an add-on called GPT for Sheets. I'm going to leave a link to it down below in the description. Let's go ahead and open it. And here I have the tab on the right side. There is a list of all of the functions that we can use. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to further classify this list of prospects because it does look like I have people here that are account executives. They're not quite executives executives, if you know what I mean. They're not CEOs. So I'm going to be using this GPT classify function. 
GPT classify. And for the value, I'm going to point to our column C and create some categories. For me, I just want to filter out non-sales executives. So I'll have a sales category and not sales category. Let's hit enter. Sounds like account executive is a sales related executive. So this is perfect. I'm going to select the first cell and drag it all the way down just like this. And just like this, with one function, went through 150 prospects and qualified them. If you've done it yourself manually, you know how long time it takes. And the lead times on working with virtual assistants are just insane. So artificial intelligence is just outstanding for classification and beyond. Do we still have jobs? I don't know. Probably not. This is the worst. <laughs> Let's create a quick filter over here. And then in this filter, we have three categories. I'm going to deselect sales and blanks. And here we have a list of all non-sales roles over here. And finally, the function we've all been waiting for is just a chat GPT function. We're going to create a prompt. So in order for us to do this, we need to combine the cells that are already in the spreadsheet with the prompt that we're creating. In order to combine these pieces, we're going to be using concatenate, it just combines pieces of information together. And let's write our prompt, write a personalized outreach message to semicolon and let's close the quotation marks and point to our row A. So it has the name and then let's open up quotation marks and continue our prompt. Their LinkedIn headline point to column C. Say that you want to connect about doing a marketing partnership with our workflow automation tool called Bardeen. Looks good to me. And then there are some other variables such as the temperature, meaning how creative you want the model to be. The value of zero is not creative at all. And value one is hyper creative. It's up to you to select what you want. I'm going to do 0.1 and I'm going to skip max tokens. And for the models, I'm also going to skip it. But if you open up your default settings here, you can select them on different types of models. You have GPT 3.5, or you can go a little bit more sophisticated, more advanced, higher quality uh, GPT 4. And because it's a default setting, let's just hit enter and see the result. Okay, that's our hyper personalized outreach message specifically to this person based on their headline. Pretty insane, huh? Let me format this a tiny bit. Resize. Okay, there we have our first message. I'm going to drag it down for all of these people. And sometimes GPT-4 model takes a little bit longer than expected. So you can just clean this cells and just drag it down again, one by one. And here we go. We have 20 hyper-personalized outreach messages. As I promised, it's literally this simple. I love it. Houston, we have a problem. How much do you think all of this crazy AI stuff just costed me? I'm just kidding. It's actually extremely cheap. I spent 41 cents to do all of the classification and to write hyper-personalized outreach messages using their most expensive model, GPT-4. So it's dirt cheap. Thanks for watching. As always, the links to all of the automations are down in the description. Try them out and let me know what you think. Hold on. Today, I showed you just one automation and I have four more crazy use cases for sales ready for you. If you want to check them out, make sure to click on this video next. Right there.